Space is not empty but filled with a superfine form of matter generated by mass defects throughout the universe. This insight transforms our current understanding of the cosmos. Joseph George's Explanation for Lorentz Transformation Effects 1. Introduction of Fine Matter as a Ubiquitous Medium Joseph George hypothesizes the existence of an extremely fine form of matter that permeates all of space. This fine matter is proposed to originate from the explosive transformation of mass defects during nuclear reactions, such as fission and fusion. Additionally, high-energy astrophysical events, including active stars, supernova explosions, neutron star collisions, and black hole mergers, contribute to large-scale mass defects throughout the universe. In contrast to the traditional view of mass energy equivalence, often represented by the equation backslash E equals MC squared backslash, where mass is converted directly into energy, George suggests that the missing mass, or delta M, instead transforms into this fine matter. 2. Interaction between moving bodies and fine matter. According to George, as objects approach the speed of light, symbolized by lowercase c, their interactions with the fine matter medium lead to observable relativistic effects. These interactions manifest primarily through two mechanisms. A. Uh, resistive drag force. Mechanism, as an object accelerates, it experiences a drag force from the fine matter medium. This force opposes the object's motion and increases non-linearly as the object's velocity approaches the speed of light. Mathematical representation, the drag force, represented by capital F with a subscript D for drag, as a function of velocity, can be described by the following equation. F sub D of V equals negative capital C, multiplied by V squared, divided by the quantity 1 minus the fraction V squared over C squared, raised to the power delta. Here, F sub D of V represents the drag force as a function of velocity, capital C is a constant representing the interaction strength between the object and fine matter, and delta is a parameter that controls the steepness of the drag increase near light speed. B. Accumulation of fine matter. Mechanism. As the object moves, it accumulates fine matter within it, effectively increasing its mass. This accumulation is proportional to the square of the velocity and becomes significant as the object nears the speed of light. Mathematical representation. The effective mass of the object at velocity v, represented as m of v, is given by the equation. m of v equals m0, multiplied by the quantity 1 plus the fraction beta times v squared, over the difference c squared minus v squared. In this equation, m of v represents the effective mass of the object at velocity v, m0 is the rest mass of the object, and beta is a dimensionless parameter representing the rate of fine matter accumulation. 3. Manifestation of relativistic effects through fine matter interactions. George attributes traditional relativistic phenomena to interactions with the fine matter medium rather than to space-time geometry. Specifically, a uh, length contraction mechanism, the compressive pressure exerted by fine matter in the direction of motion leads to contraction of the moving object's length. Mathematical representation, the length of the object at velocity v, represented as L of v, can be calculated by the equation. L of V equals L0, multiplied by the square root of 1 minus the fraction V squared over C squared. In this equation, L of V represents the length of the object at velocity V, and L0 is the rest length of the object. B. Mass increase. Mechanism, the accumulation of fine matter results in an effective increase in the object's mass as its velocity rises. Relation to drag, the resistive drag force and mass increase are interconnected, both arising from interactions between the object and the fine matter medium. C. Universal speed limit. Mechanism, the infinite drag force as velocity approaches the speed of light, enforces a universal speed limit, preventing objects from reaching or exceeding light speed. 4. Comparison with special relativity. While special relativity explains Lorentz transformations through space-time geometry, where time and space coordinates transform across different frames of reference without involving any physical medium, Joseph George's hypothesis introduces a physical medium, namely fine matter, that interacts with moving objects to produce similar relativistic effects. This approach offers a mechanistic explanation rather than a purely geometric one. 5. Implications and Experimental Considerations George's model suggests several profound implications. Space as a medium, space, filled with fine matter, influences all physical processes, challenging the traditional vacuum concept. Gravitational phenomena, effects such as gravitational lensing and the bending of light could be explained by variations in fine matter density affecting light propagation through refractive mechanisms, offering an alternative to the concept of space-time curvature in general relativity. 
empirical testing, specific predictions, such as resistive drag at relativistic speeds and mass accumulation, could be tested through high-energy particle experiments and astrophysical observations. Conclusion Joseph George's explanation for Lorentz transformation effects introduces a new framework in which interactions with a hypothesized fine matter medium account for phenomena traditionally explained by the geometrical structure of spacetime and special relativity. This approach provides a mechanistic alternative for understanding time dilation, length contraction, and mass increase at relativistic speeds.